Magnetic Damping Motional EMF is an electromotive force that is induced by a motion relative to the magnetic field. This can cause something called an eddy current. Eddy currents happen when there is a change in a magnetic field within a conductor inducing electric current loops in the conductor. Eddy currents can strain the motion that is involved causing something called magnetic damping. This is because the damping that occurs converts the kinetic energy into heat energy causing it to slow down and heat up. The first part of this image shows a metal pendulum being swung through the magnetic field of a horseshoe magnet. The motion of the pendulum is damped and the speed has been reduced greatly. The second part of this image shows a slotted metal pendulum being swung through the same magnetic field. This time, the eddy currents don't have much effect on the motion and the speed after passing through the field is similar to it before entering the magnetic field. As seen in the image to the right, slotted metals have a smaller eddy current because the electric loops that can form are fewer due to the decrease in surface area. Also, the electric current loops in slotted metals are aligned and adjacent. The currents of these loops are opposite in direction to the loops next to them, cancelling out their effects. This nullifies the eddy current that should have occurred. The image on the left shows that as a metal plate enters the magnetic field, flux increases, and thus, according to Faraday's law and Lenz's law, a counterclockwise eddy current is made. The current, therefore, is towards the pivot point and a force is exerted on the metal plate opposite to the direction it was heading according to the right hand rule 3, slowing it down. The magnetic field itself is all uniform, so no eddy currents form. Once the plate exits the magnetic field, another force is exerted on the plate opposite to the motion again, slowing it down even more. Now we're going to look at an application of magnetic damping. Eddy current brakes are used to slow down a moving object without the use of friction. This is a major application of magnetic damping. A conductive metal plate that moves past a magnet that is stationary will induce eddy current due to the magnetic field, Faraday's law. These currents will make their own magnetic field to oppose the magnetic field of the stationary magnet, Lenz's law. This dampers the movement by creating a drag force that is opposite in direction to the motion and proportional to the velocity of the moving object. The electrical energy of these currents is turned into heat energy because of the electrical resistance. This type of braking can be done using a stationary electromagnet making it so that the magnitude of the braking can be controlled by the amount of current within the magnet's windings. Since there is no friction, the brakes will not wear out, so replacements are not needed. However, since the opposing force is proportional to the velocity, when the object is not moving, there is nothing to hold it in place. There is no holding force. This means that the object must also be accompanied by a friction brake. Eddy current brakes are used in roller coasters and high speed trains. Now we're going to look at the societal impact of this. The application of magnetic damping affects society in a positive way. It helps people travel faster and have fun. Magnetic damping is used to slow down really fast vehicles such as high speed trains and roller coasters. Without magnetic damping, it is impossible to stop very high speed vehicles because the friction on the brakes will be too much to handle. It will release an immense amount of heat and could very well destroy the brakes after one use. Magnetic damping helps slow down the train and roller coaster enough without friction so that a friction brake can be used to hold it stationary so that the brakes don't wear out. This allows for the use of high speed trains that help people travel faster and roller coasters which allow people to have fun. The End Created using Powtoon.